it looks like a typical night to me. That guy looks like he's trying way too hard to be a cool and dangerous. That's so. Go on ahead. Be mad this bomb! What's that even about? I'm pretty sure that's cheating. Unless it's allowed, then... I mean, he followed the rules, so... Maybe he forgot the language? Nah. Mom's a native, so I'm sure he must talk with her enough to stay fresh with his skills. Oh, wow! That's a cool skate shop! There's all sorts of colors... ...and materials... ...and... Ooh... Maybe I should get back into skating. So... I'm afraid if I do, my owner might want to skate too. And last time, well, she didn't fall, but I'm afraid she's gonna break something. Is your arm getting tired? You need a break? No, I can do this. I'm fine. Isn't that how it works? They ask you, are you fine? And you say, yeah, I'm fine, but on the inside, you're not fine. No? Is that not how you humans act? What was your name again? Langa Hasegawa, age 17, nationality Canadian. Thank you, Carla. Huh? Is is that a robot? It's one of those robot assistants, isn't it? What's your name, Carla? <laughs> Usually, when you start off on a skateboard, you want somebody to hold on to you. Uh, at least you're holding something. That's what I did with my own logic. Okay. Get on, but don't let go of me. It's okay. And then, BAM! I'm just kidding, she didn't fall, but she was really close to doing it. Lanka, get me the scissors from the tool box. What the hell are you doing?! Is he taping his feet to the board? Is that safe? Hey, please don't tell me that's duct tape! It'll keep the board from slipping off my feet. That's not a good thing! Wait! Is he taping it because your feet have to stick to your board and snowboard it? Is he gonna treat the skateboard like a snowboard? I don't know if that's a good idea, but... Hey, I'm excited to see what happens. No. He'll be the one to skate. Cherry? Well, that was nice of Cherry to speak up for Zanga. I wonder why he has faith in him. Maybe because he saw that Zanga was like, Oh, wow. Skateboard looks cool. Unless he might have mentioned his snowboarding background during his job interview, which I doubt, but we'll see. What? What are you doing? Uh Zanga, you kinda need to kick off. I uh-huh, okay. Um well good luck with that. Oh, Langa's in the zone now. Bye bye, Shadow. No way. I'm gonna ride ahead. Wanna come? Okay, does everyone own a motorcycle in this town? Also, that looks expensive. How rich is Cherry? Actually, no, I take that back. He has a robot AI assistant. So I, I really shouldn't be surprised if he's. Fabulous and rich and has a really cool motorcycle. I was observing the way your friend skates and I noticed something about how he distributes his weight on the board. His posture is balanced and the way he braces his feet is practiced. It made me wonder if he might be a high level snowboarder. Oh, that's how he knew. Because he was observing him. He's like, huh, that, that looks like a snowboarder. Oh, wow. Terry's rich, hot, and smart. Damn! He probably really popular, huh? <laughs> I'm sorry, who's this creepy, spiky haired gentleman who likes to stand in front of screens half naked? What is going on? Go, go! 
Wait, wait, Langa, what are you doing? That looks dangerous. Langa! Wow, he actually made it! Oh, okay, I was worried there, but I know I'm pretty sure Langa's gonna win. Wow! That was so cool! I knew he would win! Oh, wow! Ooh, we better to watch the next episode, DJ. Ooh, that was fun! Call me crazy, but I know what I saw. The snowflakes began to fall. Well, that was episode one. Personally, I really liked it. I thought it was cool. I find it interesting that Zanga has no experience with skateboarding, but he's very knowledgeable in snowboarding, so that seemed to work out really well. And as far as like in the characters, they all seem pretty interesting. Except Shadow, I want to punch him in the face. But Terry seems really cool, and Ricky just seems like a very earnest young man who loves skateboarding. So I am curious why Zanga moved from Canada to, you know, Okinawa. It seems like he really loves snowboarding, so why did he leave? Anyways, hopefully the next couple episodes will tell us if I recommend this. I do. I really do. This looks really fun. And, you know, very... how do I put it? Unpredictable. You just don't know what's gonna happen. Because you thought, oh wow, maybe Lang is not gonna win, maybe he is gonna win. And, I mean, it does give you hints that he is a snowboarder. But it doesn't stay up tell you until Terry mentioned it to Reiki, like, Hey, you know that kid? Yeah, I think he snowboards, so he should be fine. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. Bye, everybody!